Right before I drive away to forget Why do I give a damn at everything we say G'day guys, Chaos Chronicle, it's Biff here, the toughest guy in the world, which is bringing me to my next video. So absolutely, I am not the toughest guy in the world, but I'm just having a little bit of a joke because of some of the comments. But um, yeah, I guess I wanted to make this video um, just to let people know that um, if I'm giving off the message that I'm trying to say that I'm the toughest person in the world and no one can beat me up and this and that, that's absolutely not the message um, I'm trying to put out there. I'm trying to help the youth and let people know that if they do exactly what I did, that they're going to end up in prison, they're going to end up being stabbed, shot, whatever. And so that's what I'm trying to do here. But I guess, you know, it's I'm, I need to, you know, make light of the situation. So, yeah, I absolutely um, don't think that I was the toughest person in any prison that I was in. Um Never have I said that and never will I say that because do I think that I'm the craziest and toughest person in prison, in the prison system? Absolutely not. Um, and will I say that there are so many more people that are so much more crazier than me? And um, yeah, like I, I just hope that, that that's not the message that um, – that I'm putting off here because that's absolutely not the message that I'm trying to put off. And, um, yeah, you know, I'm just trying to talk about my life and my crazy experiences and, you know, just trying to show the youth and, and then the, and the young men of today that, um, there's much more, um, better things in life, um, than gangs, crime, drugs, prison, you know, it's all a fake, fake life. And, um, yeah, you know, I lived it hard for 20 years and, um, you know, I used to do TikTok stuff, um, before I done YouTube. Um, I'm not, not sure if a lot of you people know this, but, um, I actually did paranormal for, for a couple of years before I did YouTube and, um, you know, I'm a firm believer of the paranormal. A lot of you might not agree with that. You know, that's that's your opinion. And apparently they're like bumholes and everyone's got an opinion, you know. Um, but, um, you yeah, know, that's, that's what I did. And anyway, I amassed, um, you know, over 170,000 followers in a pretty rapid time um, on TikTok. And then, you know, people wanted to, to hear my stories and... Um, yeah, so, you know, it all started off, you know, I was, I was doing live ghost hunts on um, on TikTok and I'm talking well before Spanion or any of them. I was actually, so I actually still to this day in regards to how many followers I have and, and whatnot, am the largest ghost hunter paranormal investigator in Australia. And um, so, yeah, I did this long before Spanion and that did it. And that's no disrespect to Spanion or, or any of them other guys that did it, but I'm just saying that I was out there doing it first, that's for sure. And, you know, um, so I, I would do my live shows and then people were actually coming on to um, my live shows and trying to, like, tell people that I'd been to prison, this and that. And so um, I wasn't hiding it. I just didn't um, choose the option to tell anyone about that. Um, but as soon as people started asking about it, you know, I started telling my life story and, um, you know, people told me that I should start a YouTube. I've got some pretty interesting things that have happened to me in my life and, you know, um, yeah, so I just want people to know that, you know, I'm not out here trying to trying to make you all think that I'm the toughest person in the world. That's just not, not who I am, you know. But let's not get this twisted, you know. If you tested me in prison, and I don't care who you are, you know what I mean? There are people here in these comment sections that can second that, you know, I have gone in single-handedly, one out and, you know, um, and done some crazy things where people would usually go in with a few people. So I guess what I'm saying is, you know, I live by the, those rules, those jail rules, the G code, whatever you want to call it, I lived by it. And if you broke those rules and, and you know, I, I would enforce 
the 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 G law, you know, and um, you know, I, I'm not the only one that does this. This is what prison is like. Everyone is the same as me in prison, you know. Everyone should act when someone insults them in prison, and the only reason I say that is because, like, I've made light of it on other videos that you know. People will 100%, you know, take your kindness for a weakness. And if you let someone get anything over you, then you can guarantee you for the rest of your stay in that prison that you are going to be getting, you know, hounded by by these other people. So, you know, I took a stand from the very time I walked in those prison doors and said that I'm ne never going to let anyone put their hands on me and get away with it. And um, I don't care whether you're a prison guard, a screw, or, or, or if you're a crook, you know, a prisoner. I, I, I did not care. If you put your hands on me, it, it was Donkey Kong on. And, you know, win, lose, or draw, I'm having a crack. Am I out there saying that I've never lost a fight? No, I'm absolutely not, you know. Um, you know, I, I, I've lost many a fights, you know. And unfortunately, every single one of them fights was, you know, when when I was, you know, outnumbered, you know, um, and so you know, it it is what it is. I, I'm I'm not out here trying to say that I'm the toughest person, and um, you know, I just hope you guys, hope you guys know that that's that's not the go. But um, yeah, which which leads me to the next bit of my video. So over the last few days, um, I've been doing um an interview with the Herald Sun. So they contacted me um, from my YouTube page and, you know, said that they'd like to do a story on, um, you know, what I'm doing here on YouTube. And, um, you know, so I guess, you know, that, that just seconds my belief that people are actually hearing my message that drugs, jail and crime is, is, is not a life. And, you know, all this rap music and all this bullshit, what the teenagers listen to at the moment, will try and enforce that this is the life you want to live, cash chicks cars this and that but it, it's all a bullshit life and um yeah but anyway they um they 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 contacted me and um wanted to do an interview with me about my youtube so that's pretty much all i'm gonna say i find out today whether it's going to be this weekend or next weekend but it's definitely going to be this weekend or next weekend so keep your eyes out for that but i will do a post as soon as i know the um particulars on when it's going to be coming out so you guys can all grab a herald sun i'm pretty sure you can grab herald suns in other states i know that when i was in queensland i used to buy the herald sun sometimes and um so i know you can do it um but yeah you know which which leads me to to the end of my video where i usually say you know don't do drugs jail and crime um it, it's a bullshit life you know and it, and it really really is and um you know if you watch my my stories and watch my clips i'll reinforce that why why it's a shit life and you know every single time that i thought i was doing something good like money wise or whatever you know, the bad karma always got me back in the end, you know, which leads to the old adage, you know, or that old song, I fought the law and the law won. It's absolutely 100% true. And, um, yeah, I fought the law and the law definitely won every time. Don't get me wrong. There was times when I did win. But in the big picture, in, in, in a whole of things, the, the law bet me every single time. And, um, you know, the technologies and everything what police have these days, it's really hard to be a flourishing criminal anyway. So, um, yeah. There you go, guys. I've been the Chaos Chronicles um, and also the toughest guy in the world, apparently. So, um, yeah, check out my clips. Um, also, guys, if you haven't already chucked a subscribe in there, jump up there, chuck me a subscribe, smash that bell. That way you'll never miss any of my clips. And also, if you chuck a comment down, I will do my utmost best to answer your, co your comment if you've got any questions about drugs, jail, crime, gangs, bike clubs, this and that. Shoot me a question and I will do my utmost best to answer that with a video. All right, we've been the Cast Chronicles. I am also yeah. the guy who decides if you and your friends walk the out of here or not.